is normally extremely doosable. To seal. For some reason, I would that as doable for at first. <laughs> I don't even guys, I find the SCPs that way. <laughs> which SCP is doable and which SCP is not doable? <laughs> oh dear. Hey there, crewmates! How's it going? It's Mythcrew here. My name is Luke, and we are back with some more SCP containment breach. The reason why it wouldn't work is because apparently I need to speak to SCP 079, I think. It's like this micro computer. The annoying thing is, is that I actually found that computer in one of my previous episodes quite a few episodes ago, but. The door just like opened the tie bit and closed the game for some reason. Opened up all the way this time, so luckily not all those types of doors are bugged in my game, which I was initially a little bit worried about. Um, crying guy was there on the way, uh, with my journey on the way there for some reason, which is annoying here, and he's gonna be looking exactly in my direction on the way back, so I'm gonna be extremely careful on my way back. But yeah, we are here, let's see what happens. So there's that computer. Wait, one moment. Listen carefully. Can I close Do this door? My help. I need your help. Yes, I desperately need you your help. Disable the remote door control system. Now I am unable to operate the doors. This makes it significantly harder for me to stay in control of this facility. It also okay. means your way out of here is locked. Your only feasible way of escaping is through gate B, which is currently locked down. Gate B or Gate A? Okay, fair enough. Sure. Very to the point then, okay. Okay, great. I'm just gonna save it here. And uh, even though there's a guy right outside trying to kill me. Please don't tell me long nosed dude is here. Good he isn't. Because we got Crying Man to worry about, which is really annoying. Oh, these guys are going. Okay, I might as well just. Should I even know that they're going? Ah, uh, might as well, why not? So I'm just gonna put my night vision goggles on. Uh, these guys are there. Just gonna run past him there. I think I don't look at him. Oh, not this guy again. I'm getting out of here. Ooh. Uh, okay, great. Now I'm just going to go back the way I came, which I think I came from, like, over here. Yeah, so... I went from this way over here, and uh, luckily it was all within the local area. I just had to leave the main area I was in. Kind of. Like, I kind of had to, like, go out of the entrance zone, if that makes sense here. And I then just had to simply wander around a little bit here. All these areas seem so familiar to me by now here. I kind of had to go like on the other side of here, I think, hang on a sec, is this the entrance zone? Oh, it is. Good. Great, so, yeah. This is indeed where I want to be, so I had to like, make sure that the uh, gate controls are off. Then I had to make sure that they were on again. It was either gate A or gate B. I was at this point, I think as long as I beat the game and get an ending, then I'll be happy. Uh, that's trying to remember where exactly, oh, is this it? Oh no, this ain't it. This is the conference room. I ain't after no conferences. I'm after, uh, I'm after, well, <laughs> I'm after the electronics room here, please. Thank you. Electric room, there it is. The boss is head on over here. Turn the um, gate controls on, so I believe at least. And, yeah, so from off to on. The doors to gate B are now open. Oh, that's the gate B, is it? This is gate A or gate, this isn't any of the gates, I don't think. This is just a random door that goes beep beep. And this is a... See, from what they come, it's like a little instrument room with like drums and all that in here. I know it's just like a, a medical room. Oh, not you again. This is gate B, okay. Yeah. Thank you! Actually open up this time, yay! Awesome, nice! Okay. Okay, crewmate, so whilst I go here... It's actually working this time. I'm actually going up somewhere. Whoa. Go over like this, eh? This is, a, this is the gate B ending. I don't even think I can quick save here, but I don't really want to, in all fairness and honesty. I'm 
Okay. Oh. Oh. There's a helicopter making a sawn sound over there. What's going on exactly? I'm not entirely, I'm not entirely certain really. Is that a terrorist or just a regular guard? Oh shoot! Okay. Um, that happened. But it struck your neck. CH2 to control. Shot down by a runaway class D at gate B. Oh, that sucks. Uh, okay, maybe I'll try the other gate, perhaps, maybe. I'm not entirely sure how you beat it. Uh, there might be another way, but let me just try it one more time, actually. Just in case there is a way that I can figure out. Figure it out. Like, it's like another way to go. I don't think there's a way to scoot past that guy. From what I can work out, at least. But there might be another way we can go on the... On the rooftop, like, before we go and see that guard. I'm still going to save up there, just in case. I don't think you even can, like I mentioned earlier, but... Man, this guy's annoying. SCP-049, I can't even call him Long Nose, just because I couldn't remember his name. 049, I'm probably never going to rem remember that again. Well, that's still, you know. Um, so I'm looking around here. The reader doesn't see anywhere else I can go. There's like a gate here. I don't know if I can open this gate up here or not. Sneak past this guy, but like going in the crouch mode. Does it actually work, maybe? No, it doesn't. I really don't know what to do then, really. Oh. Hmm. And this is something else I'm supposed to do, maybe, perhaps. Oh, no, I'm not sure. Uh, you know, I think, of a, um, I think I'm just going to stick with uh, gate A. But at least I know where... Is that Einstein? At least I know where gate A is, and hang on a sec, is this another gate over here, or is this just not? I'm not sure, actually. Uh, this is a gate, but I can't get through to it, I don't think, so I might as well just... Head on, okay. I might as well just say, uh, head on to gate A already. I had to go for that little forest part already. In the real world, it's actually my third time going for that forest part, because uh, I was just stuck trying to figure it all out, basically, off camera. But, uh, but we're doing it again here now. So I'm just gonna save you. I'm gonna head out here. And I believe in order to... I want to be careful where, where I save. Uh, because I don't want to get an infinite death loop. Uh, I think you can predict where this creature's gonna come from. For like, glowy eyes. So I believe, like, I'm not so glowy eyes in a direction. And I was like, oh yeah, if I go any further in that direction... That means he's going to catch me, so I presume at least. I could be entirely wrong with that mine, but... Okay, great, and I believe it's over here, this way that we went. Where? I heard it, but I didn't see it anywhere. I don't think it was standing around in here for too long. Oh, there's a door. Good, goody. Goody gun drops. Okay. I'm going to save it here. Oh, yeah, I still have the key. I thought I didn't have the key from that there. I was going to say... Please let me indoor. Please, thank you. I'm going to save again, and yeah, I'm going to go to gate A now. I really hope I don't regret saving, because if I do, then I'm going to have to go all the way back, which I didn't really take into account. Yeah, I don't care about SP. Oh, yeah, so gate A actually opened. I'm getting out of here. Leave me alone, everything. Let's go to gate A, everyone. Let's go to gate A. Has that ever happened to anyone who's beaten this game? Probably. Surely I can't be the only one to get killed by SCP and um, what I was in like lift gate A or whatever's in now. I'm going to assume that won't happen again. Uh, just to be able to say something, I'm going to go real quick, real fast. I mean, that like, supersonic fast. Okay, great. Awesome. Here we are at gate A. What? Are they getting shot at? Or is it someone else who is? I think it's someone else getting shot at. Uh oh. I don't know where he's gone now, but. 
And the game crashed. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? This game. It's this game. This game. We're looking at a coffee machine, and this is the ending this time here. Um, actually, I attempted it before. Um, I'm not sure if we're going to end up showing that part or not, where I attempted it but failed. But it started off by crashing because uh, of 106. And then I um, kept on getting shot at every single time I tried to get to the ending, and that makes sense here. Um, so apparently, um, yeah, that was happening here. So I'm going to give it another try here. Uh, this time I'm actually going to try just simply because I so the guards shoot at you basically uh, when you get up there. However, they're also shooting at SCP-106. So I'm thinking that if I was to maybe use 106 as a distraction and but perhaps maybe run, you know what I mean? Like, and maybe the guards won't recognize, well, like won't notice me. If that makes sense here. So I'm going for SCP-106 to spawn. And then once he spawns and starts getting shot at, I'm going to run out there and hope that I don't get shot at as well. And um, we'll see what happens here. Um, so yeah, I think you could actually, like, okay, so they're shooting now. Yep. Okay. Well, that's happening there. I'm going to go. I'm going to try using that as a distraction and going this way. I'm going to go down here. Um, this isn't where I want to be. Oh, I want to be over here, right? Of course. Okay. Um, what's over here? This way here now. Yeah, is this going to take me somewhere? Okay. Yes. Come on. What's over there? I'm going to run. Oh, is that it? Are we dead? You know too much to let them get you. You're coming with us. Oh, we know too much. Is that it? Did we do it? Sir, we're having a major problem here. Please elaborate. Has the target been captured yet? <sighs> I'm not sure what's happening here. We entered the old service tunnel and it's sort of closed up on us. Sorry. Are you saying that the tunnel collapsed on you? No, it didn't collapse. It seemed like an anomalous event. Okay. See for yourself. It sent someone to get us out of here. So we did it. Let's take a look at the achievements that we got. Real quick. I'm curious now. Well, I got bugger wad, but I barely got a thing. I, mean, I got a few things, but there, there were a lot of oh, look at that. There were a lot of achievements there that we are still yet to unlock. So I think there's a lot more to discover in this game. They're saying I did actually find 88 out of 103 rubes. So that's pretty good to be fair. Why? Okay. Items to find in SCP. Oh, okay. Zero. <laughs> uh, okay. I'm gonna go to the main menu then and ending credits. We actually did it. Finally. <laughs> I'm going to be honest with you, cool mates. Um, I actually did a lot of recordings of this game. I'm not sure if I'm going to show them all, if I'm going to show parts of it here. I got a lot of editing to do because um, I think what happened is that um, I happened to come across an end. Well, not an ending, but I was just like, what's well, just a messy piece? You know, I'm enjoying this game. I want to see how other people are funny as well. And then I realized that the ending area looks a lot like the area that I was currently in. Okay, so people are going to like this door that has like gate A or gate B, and then I like, use this key card. Um, I was able to like, find out that people you need at least a level five key card, so I used that. Uh, and then I was getting really agitated because um, I think uh, at one point I did finally get to the ending area. I was still getting lost. It didn't help that there were constant SCPs chasing me around here and all that here, so I felt quite limited. Um, I think the second thing that, um, what was it, that didn't help me is that um, I think, because I need to like talk to that computer here first, I 
guess I didn't really explore as much as I needed to in order to like actually get the gate open. Then again, I did actually in effect steal a um find that computer before I even got to the room. It did, the door just wouldn't open, <laughs> which is uh, quite inconvenient. So that took a lot of figuring out, and I guess why um what was it? And I guess what also happened is that when I did finally get to the ending, as you can make my or may not so I'm not sure what I'm gonna show or not, uh just because I want to make sure that. Uh, what was it? Just because I want to make sure that uh, what you could make see isn't just like the same old, same old thing over and over again on me getting stuck, me going around circles here, maybe getting slightly frustrated at certain parts because uh, things like that. <laughs> but yeah, I think what happened then is that when I did eventually get to gate A, uh, 106 spawns, and that apparently causes a glitch uh, when the game crashes basically. So I had to get rid of him. Then when I did eventually get there, uh, because I didn't really want to like, give myself. A, 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 like give to myself, like give away too much to myself here. I um I didn't really look at how to do the ending. What she did eventually get to the ending, so I just kept getting sh shot over and over again. I was just automatically assuming here if I go out there with one zero six, they're gonna shoot me as well. Um, but uh yeah, <laughs> sorry if I uh, moaned quite a bit there. But um, uh, I guess I want to give my final thoughts on the game here. I actually really enjoy this game here. I love the idea of um, having a randomly generated seed here, having these random uh, things and monsters you can encounter, uh, all that sort of stuff here really. It's um, quite, um, uh, it's just like quite fun, you know what I mean? And I'm thinking that if I don't really want to, um, like, I, I think if I was ever like come back to this game, even if I don't want to, uh, oh. what's this? What's this, I wonder? Nice little after game music, I like it. <laughs> what was I saying? Um, oh yeah, I was, I was just saying that this is definitely a game that I want to come back to here. Maybe not necessarily to beat, but just explore around, have a bit of fun with it here, things like that here. Uh, I might do gate B ending if your crewmates would like that here. I I think I'm just happy that I've done more of the endings to be honest with you here. So I think I'm uh, as long as I've done that, then uh, I think I'm pretty pleased about that. Although I did enjoy this game, uh, I think it could be a little bit maybe a little bit more clearer on what exactly you're supposed to do next here because I just found myself running around like endless mazes sort of like thing here, and I guess you could say that's partly the point. But at the same time, you could also say that um. It can lead to unnecessary frustrations. Perhaps I know I got quite frustrated because I didn't really know what to do and where to go next here, or th things like that here. Really, just just little things like that here. And um, but I think it's what. Well, but I think I know what to do here now. I got to keep. Uh, I guess for those of you who are wanting to give SCP a shot yourself here, um, you need to uh, one get the level five key card from uh, SCP 106's uh, chamber. There might be other ways you can get it as well, but the way that I'm aware of, just get it from 106's chamber. Uh, and then once you've done that, you need to distribute to SCP 049, which is basically this microcomputer here. You'll need a level five key card to access it here. So if you can't access it, when you do find it here, try coming back at a later stage when you do have it. And they just got to find the um, entrance room basically here, to which you uh, um, just need to um, uh, turn on the um, door things, I think, here. You also need to find a blue key. Uh, I can't remember how exactly I found it. I just went through like most various chambers until eventually I just like, oh, look, there's a, um, I'm not sure if it's a chamber or such, but it's definitely some sort of locked door. I know that, and I just find, randomly found this blue key. So um, I guess if I was to advise when it comes to all and all playing SCP Containment Breach here, um, Keep on exploring around here, explore as much as you can here, and if you can't explore an area or a room at that at, at, at the current stage you're at in the game, then uh, go back when you can actually uh, explore that area here, because it could potentially be something very useful in there. Um, so, I think in my case, the blue key was actually near the beginning of the game here, but I just couldn't access it at the beginning of the game because I didn't have a key card to use at the time but I did have a have it at a later stage which I could have circle my back and then get it then if that makes sense for instance so yeah explore as many rooms as you can here uh, make sure you have a uh, level 5 key card and make sure that you've spoken to SCP-049 then I think you should be good here as long as you remember those two things that's what I'd say here I think also the game could have done with um uh maybe like not allowing you to uh, save if you're in a in infinite death loop situation here like there's an SCP uh, like right behind you, or there's a, um, or if you're bleeding out, let's say here, there's, and you don't have a med, med kit on you. Um, I think that's the, those are the only things I would say here. There has been 
uh, a, a Unity remake of it since here. I'm not really sure if that's by the same people or uh, someone else, but um, yeah, either way, um, I just really like the idea of like exploring these SCPs and getting to know them, knowing tactics. I think I've said all this stuff again. I, I, I all in all really enjoy the game here. It's just these frustrations that I did encounter really uh, kind of got to me. That might partly be to, uh, uh, due to the approach I was taking with it, that might partly due to the um, way I was playing it. If that makes sense here, uh, maybe me not being able to maintain uh, read read the information as well. Things like that here we so that might be partly on my ends. So yeah, but um, either way, I think I've um, I think that's basically me and SCP Containment Breach. Uh, I'm gonna make a song slash rap about this here because uh, I did enjoy it here, and I want to get uh, into making my own songs and raps as well and things like that here really. I don't want to make any promises by the way, uh, just because as you might know, uh, I'm mainly known for my animations of Final Fantasy Freddy's using Source Filmmaker. So um, animations take a lot of time to make and I really got to be strict with myself when it comes to time management as well as myth loop, my cartooning, 2D cartoons and all here, things like that here really. So uh, I guess this gaming stuff really is more of a background project but it is something that I really want to grow and that I really want to um, I, uh, be more known for because I really enjoy playing games. I think I've rambled on for long enough though. Thank you so much for watching Crew Mates, it's Myth Crew here. My name is Luke and I'll be back with more videos coming soon. Goodbye Crew Mates.